with us this morning as well is private legal practitioner, one of the foremost human rights lawyers that we have in this country. He has contributed to the legal jurisprudence in Ghana, and he continues to do that as well. He's the leader of one of three individual bondholder groups and also the convener of the Kumi Prekurilode demonstration. Martin Pebu, good morning to you, sir. Welcome. Yeah, morning, Mr. Kansi. Morning. Ah, you know what, Mr. So Kansi, of me. course, as usual, I have a few greetings to do before uh, we zoom in. But before I greet uh, Garman, uh, uh, Yasan, Tuasso, Fekufu, and the rest, mm. ah, something just hit me. You know what? And I think, look, we should, maybe we need the experts. I don't usually buy food from outside. No, mm -hmm. I don't like even all the glazy hotel foods. No, I just like to eat food from my home, mm -hmm. right? But, you know, this cost of living crisis thing, I just, you know, last week I brought Kiki. Yeah, we're going to have a conversation So yesterday, today. I decided <clears throat> that my assistant should buy me wachi. So mm -hmm. let me see. The wachi I got, this morning as I was rushing here, I forgot. Okay, but the cuckoo is here. We'll soon put it up here. The wachi was 31 Ghana cities, right? Mm. So I just decided to multiply 31 by 30 days. So, mm -hmm. and I'm getting 930 Ghana cities. Mm -hmm. So if you pay an employee 3,000 Ghana cities a month, mm -hmm. oh, and you know, private sector, you're a small lawyer, you pay an employee 3,000, you think you've done well, ah, man. That's true. Ah, then it turns out that one third of it is just lunch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the 31 Ghana cities times 30. Yes. You're getting mm -hmm. 900. 30 Ghana cities. That's assuming the person spends 31 cities every day yeah. on food. Yes. And, the, and, and, and that's and lunch. Much of, much of it as well will be taken by transportation and the others. Uh -huh. So it doesn't so, come in. So I'm like, ah, yeah, I'm doing it. Unless maybe I got it wrong. No, no, you're 31 right. 31 times 30. No, you're you're right, getting 930 right. Ghana. Right. So with 3,000 Ghana, you know, you may be feeling, oh, you've done well. Yeah, I pay a see 3,000 mm. Ghana. You think you've done well. But one third of it, that's it's lunch. Mm. Oh, no, we can't. Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Yeah. We we'll, 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 yeah. depending we'll, on the location of your office. If your office happens to be located in some other areas where a lot of offices are located, you may not even get 31. Yeah. It will yes. be higher. Yes, mm. yeah, you're perfectly right. Uh, yeah, the 31 know. is yeah. when you send a person very far, possibly from your office, yeah. to have to spend a lot to even get there. Yeah. That's yeah. where you will get yeah. the 31. Yeah. We'll, we'll oh, have that cost of living crazy. conversation, crazy. all of it. We'll, we'll bring it home. <laughs> No, no, Beyond no, 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 what the no. economic statistics we can't say. Do that. Let so, me just Abe, say. Let me mm. greet uh, uh, Garmanche. Okay. Hey, because Garmanche, you can't start this program without greeting mm. Garmanche. Garmanche, Kentucky Teko Chiru, the mm. second. Good morning. Morning and morning and morning once again. Of course, mm. your question still remains How can Cecilia Dapa alone have so much money under her bed? That is the question duty bearers have to answer. You need accountability, and I'll continue to repeat that question here. Garmanche is asking duty bearers, Yoko, uh, Attorney General, how can one person have so much money under her bed? Number two, uh, Kofi Aflu's uh, petition to the Speaker to force uh, Auditor General Johnson Ekuyamwa Esedu to bring the report on the missing 52.5 billion Ghana cities. Mm -hmm. We are still waiting since December 4th. We will not forget. We need that report out. Okay. 52.5 yeah. billion. How much did we go to the IMF for? For crying out loud. Three billion. And that was December 2020. That's way more than how much we've gone to borrow from the IMF. You can't have this money missing for four years, and then it's like business goes on as usual. We will not take that. Of course, Yas Antoine Sofayekufu, former Chief Justice. Good morning. Good morning. More fire. We need you to continue to step out to, uh, you know, help the governance of this country. And mm. finally, Dormahini, or say adieu, your Dr. Ajiman Bedou II. Good morning. 